Welcome, in front of me I have Redmi Watch 5 Lite and I'm gonna show you how to enable the phone notifications for this watch on the Android phone. Basically, if you want to receive the notifications from your phone on your watch. Before we start, if you want to receive the notifications from your phone on your watch, your watch needs to be paired with your phone via the Mi Fitness application. And once the devices are paired together, we can open the uh, Mi Fitness application on the phone that is paired with our watch. In the app, you should see the health page. Now tap on the device icon to open the device page. And on it, there should be Redmi Watch 5 Lite. Now, scroll through this page and find the option called notifications and calls. Tap on it. And here we have app notifications and incoming calls. Basically, the notifications for the applications on your phone and the incoming calls. So somebody, if somebody calls you, the watch will vibrate and uh, display who's calling you. First, let's tap on app notifications. And as you can see, we don't have the required permissions allowed for the notifications to work. So we need to tap on OK. Find the uh, Mi Fitness application on the list. Tap on it. Oh, maybe the first one. For some reason, there's two of them. So let's tap on the first one. Tap on the switch next to allow notification access. Tap on allow. And once you allow the notification access, let's go back to the Mi Fitness application. And as you can see, now we can enable the notifications. And here we can also customize some of the settings. We can enable or disable the option to receive only when the phone is locked. So basically, if you're using your phone and the screen is turned on on your phone, you won't be receiving the notifications on your watch. Uh, option to wake screen when you receive the notifications and notify only when worn. So basically, if I won't disable this option and the watch is on the desk, you won't see the notifications on it. Uh, you will only see them when you have your uh, watch on your wrist, basically. Uh, and below we have more options and here we have mirror phone notification options or custom notifications. You can select um, this option and it will basically mirror the settings from your phone. And if you enable this option, it will bring the list of applications and you can enable and disable the notifications for specific apps. And how it works is basically if you enable the notification for the Discord, for example, and you will see the notific or receive the notification from Discord on your phone, that notification will be forwarded to your watch. But if you disable it, it won't be forwarded to your watch. You will see it only on your phone. Okay, and once you're done uh, with the app notifications, you can go back, tap on incoming calls. You can enable the optimize incoming call notifications. And if you don't have the required permissions enabled, you will need to tap on allow and allow the required permission. Next, we have sh show contact info. So basically, it will display who is calling you and you can enable it and you will need to allow the required permissions if it's not allowed. And also you can uh, enable the option to reply with reply with message. And if you enable this option, you will need to allow another permission basically. And you can then set the quick responses. So you can add new response. You can edit the previous ones or you can remove them uh, to edit the response. Do, can we edit the response? No, we can't. So we can only, oh, no, never mind. You can press and hold on it and edit it. Yeah. Uh, you can also remove them, like I said. So we can click, tap edit, tap here, tap the check mark to confirm. And that's about all, basically. Okay. So now my notifications should be working because I enabled them. So I'm going to send myself a message on Discord and we'll see if it's uh, working. So we got the notification on our phone and I believe we also got it on our watch and we did and we can uh, dismiss it. And if you miss the notifications, I believe you can swipe down from the top of the screen to open the notification panel. And here we have the notifications from our phone. And that's how you enable the phone notifications for this watch on the uh, Android phone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving a like on the video.